Uh, I'm going to show you something uh, while Damiano is working. Eh? Mm. Something new. Mi apre il cateterino. Il cateterino. Ah. Okay. So what I'm going to show you, this uh, is uh, right. a yes. What's the size of the balloon, please? Point five non-compliant. We are inflating at the sixteen atmosphere right now. Okay, you see these. Uh, my Chris. It's a small catheter, monorail, Sage. with the pressure Special. producer at the beginning. It's the same size of the O16 wire. And uh, you can go monorail on any wire and measure FFR, PAPD, and stuff like that. So this is a micro catheter or? Uh Micro catheter, monorail micro catheter. If I will zoom. That's new. And the Can you zoom on it with the camera? Yes. There we are. And they. And they. It, it was, we had one before from Braco, and this one is uh, uh, from Aircon. Aircon. It's, the, it's made Yukon. in China. It's a very <laughs> okay. nice technology. It's a little bit uh, upgraded compared to the one of Bracco. Uh, very stable. And uh, the advantage of uh, uh, having uh, to use on a regular wire is enormous. Piccolino. We can even measure the gradient uh, on the LED. Let's Did you dilate the, the diagonal? Yes, 2.5, Okay, let's measure the gradient on the diagonal. Okay, let's make a, a, sh a shot yeah. and then uh, let's measure. Okay, no not use dissection. dissection. Yes, not dissected. Let's measure a gradient. Go on the diagonal. So do you have to remove the wire or you keep the wire? No, no, no. you go of on the wire. the wire. On the wire. On the wire. This is a rapid exchange, huh? This is a rapid exchange, huh? Yeah. Yes. yes. And this is a great advantage because you know all these FFR wires are not so easy steerable. Uh, and here you just, any wire you have, you can advance it. And with a very low profile, which will not occlude the ostium. So it's O16 wire. Okay, we're gonna come out uh, from the guide, uh, stop there. We're going to do equalization. Faccio un altro equalize. Okay, now is one. Okay, it's fine. Okay, so the equal. If can you see? Yeah, you see the screen. Okay, let's go down. Okay, we are distant. Let me close this. So we have uh, not a lot. Eh? Uh, can you press uh, CR, CR, CRR? CRR is quello in alto a destra. So okay. this is the IFR. IFR 90 is not so bad. Not so bad. I think uh, uh, if, uh, if I were the patient, I would uh, ask to have a drug coated balloon there. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, yeah. you know, I let uh, Dr. Yeah. Reimers decide. So I, I would, now I think we can go for the provisional technique. Provisional, provisional. So far, provisional technique, we still are able to uh, so we are on the make this worse. Line, border line. <laughs> so I, I would yeah. say, uh, uh, however, this, as good uh, as this however, one this after the stent. <laughs> this reading is after balloon dilatation for the diagonal. Exactly. I mean, so ideally, process get 0.93 or 0.95. Okay. This is cool, but I think it's okay. Excellent. Cool, but it's okay. but uh, uh, I like to see the reading not okay. now, yeah. uh -huh. but in six months. And I think the reading, <laughs> if a place is tent in six months, uh, 
I don't know what it is. <laughs> okay. okay, I think we can go with the stent on the LED. So, so let's keep it provisional. What do you yeah. think? Provisional. Yes. So How long? 3.5. 30 onyx. What, 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 what size are them? 3.5 stent, uh, maybe we'll do pot proximally with 4 o onyx, uh, 30 millimeter length. Antonio, when you use the provisional, do you open the struts into the, uh, the branch? The branch? Uh, yes, yes, we open the struts. We open the struts and maybe we dilate a little bit more aggressively and the diagonal. But uh, and, and, uh, and you finish with a kissing balloon, huh? Catheter. Yeah, you know, tell me, but you did not tell how much you like this catheter. <laughs> so the crossing yeah, profile, it's very, very nice. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this is, uh, we, 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 love we love it, we love it. So. We love it. You know, this catheter is the best. <laughs> the best. This is Actually, it's, it's very, very nice because, you know, it makes life easy. Life easy. Okay, thank you, thank you. <laughs> That's what I wanted to hear. I love this catheter. Yeah, let's let's see, see the last. Uh... Okay. Last chance to show you the gradient. Cal una calibration. I think that is. I just had to. Yes, yes. Andava be. Usiamo col catheter di guida. Okay. So let's see the gradient. So uh -huh. the no. gradient. While well, waiting for the gradient, <laughs> home, take home message from uh, Hamza Sophi and then Mohammed and Fahad Basli. Every 30 seconds, each of you. Yeah, uh, my, um, yes, you have to uh, think for the strategy and sometimes you can change your strategy. But the, the important part is uh, preparation of the lesion in order to reach the conclusion which types uh, of uh, bifurcation technique are going to use. Ahmed. Yeah, I mean, uh, as uh, Subhi said, I mean, you have to plan your strategy first and uh, know with the tools that you have in the cat lab. Uh, prepare the legion very well. And do, I mean, uh, the technique that you are good in, not to invent you know, new techniques. No, look, uh, huh? at the PDPA is 94. This is good. very good, Antonio. PDPA is 94, and, uh, and IFR, they call it the CRR for uh, uh, patent reason, but his IFR is 93, 92. So okay. I would say it's not a super result, but it's a reasonable result. Uh, if you want, uh, you can do nothing. I would personally do a gentle uh, drug coated balloon, and that's, uh, that's it. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.